This is a short video to demonstrate using a Raspberry Pi as an iBeacon scanner. For this demonstration, there are two iBeacons, each configured with different major and minor values. Currently only Beacon A with a major of 4 twos and a minor of 4, 5, 6, 7 is switched on. This Model B Plus Pi has an additional Wi-Fi adapter and Bluetooth 4.0 adapter and is configured to start scanning for beacons once booted up. The data collected from the Raspberry Pi iBeacon scans is being pushed to a remote web server which we can view on this terminal screen. As the scan starts automatically, we can see that Beacon A has already been detected. The data collected for each iBeacon is the MAC address of the device, the UUID major and minor values which are used to identify it as an iBeacon, the static transmission power of the beacon and the received signal strength indication value. The final piece of data is the scan ID which is the MAC address of the scanning device, in this case a Raspberry Pi. As only Beacon A is currently switched on, it is only the data for Beacon A we are currently receiving. If we turn off Beacon A and switch on Beacon B, we can see that it is immediately detected by the Raspberry Pi scan. If we have both beacons switched on, both will be detected and have their data displayed. To finish will be a demonstration of the Pi with multiple beacons to detect, in this case 11. The 11 eye beacons are found in the first scan. Some of these eye beacons have matching UUIDs, majors and minors but are separate physical devices with differing MAC addresses. And then the second scan begins a detection process once again.